हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल आई एम डॉक्टर कैलाश एंड आई एम ए वेटनेशन सर्जन वर्किंग इन दी गवर्नमेंट ऑफ ओडिशा सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट दी प्रोस्टाग्लैंड हार्मोन दैट इज फ्रीक्वेंटली एंड मोस्ट प्रोफाउंडली यूज्ड इन वेटनरी एज वेल एज मेडिकल सेक्टर्स सो दिस हार्मोन इज ऑल्सो ए टोल्ड एज ए मैजिक हार्मोन सो लेट्स डिस्कस एंड नो अबाउट समथिंग अबाउट दिस हार्मोन हॉप दिस वीडियो विल be helpful to many researchers many academicians and the many doctors as well as the farmers let's see coming to the historical background it was first discovered by wolf von heller in the year 1930 this scientist uh, always in news or always in the question paper of many students like in neet as well as the veterinary semester examination semester examination as well ICAR examinations. As this name suggests, it is a prostaglandin. So many researchers, many scientists thought that it was uh, as it is. Uh, it was uh, first isolated from the prostatic fluid from the prostate. So the name was given according to the uh, region. In the year nineteen sixty two, the chemical structure of the prostaglandin was identified. The detailed structure, how 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 the structure was. and the three d molecule structures all the uh, st- structures all the information regard to the structure was discovered in 19 in the year 1962 so coming to the chemistry of the prostaglandin it is mostly a fatty acid derivative and mostly arachidonic acid derivative which is twenty carbon atoms so uh, i request to the students or academicians please they remember the uh, carbon atom numbers of prostaglandin which is short form of pg the estrogen the progesterone please because the number of carbon atoms uh, has been frequently asked in the examinations in uh, semester examination as well as icer pg as well as the seniors research fellow examinations okay coming to the latter on uh, pg identified in body tissue which perform different physiological functions so many researchers thought that as it was Uh, derived from the prostatic fluid so uh, the action is confined to the your uh, genital system but later the scientist the scientist uh, told that uh, besides your reproductive function it has also many other physiological function and controls the vital system of our body so pg is not considered so pg is the prostaglandin it's not considered as a typical hormone because after synthesis it acts nearby or on the same organ so when we uh, see the uh, definition of a hormone so it tells hormone secre- hormone synthesized in a particular organ and it acts at a distal organ distal organ via blood okay but so it is known as a endocrine hormone but this is what the scientists they are telling pg is not considered a hormone because the prostaglandin synthesis takes place the prostaglandin synth- the prostaglandin synthesis takes place in the endometrial gland suppose this is the uterus this is the endometrial gland the synthesis takes place here and it acts nearby structure that is your corpus luteum that is on your ovary so so many researcher many scientists they prefer to classify this uh, substance as a paracrine substance okay that's why as the, the uh, mode of action is uh, very nearer to its synthesis so pg is not appeared in the blood so prostaglandin never appear in the blood very very important so in many tissues also so not on not only the endometrial lining synthesizes the uh, prostaglandin many other tissues like your lungs intestine also secretes uh, a different kinds of prostaglandins uh you you might know that when there is some uh, anaphylactic reaction or there is any anaphylactic reaction or there is uh, allergic type of reactions there is synthesis of prostaglandin from your arachidonic acid and this prostaglandin causes acute inflammations coming to the next slides so how this how the synthesis of prostaglandin occurred so in the blood 
vessels there are uh, membrane phospholipids are there phospholipid bilayer is there so in the presence of phospholipids a2 this phospholipids uh, are converted to the arachidonic acid so this is the main precursor for the synthesis of the prostaglandin so when cox1 cox1 and cox2 enzymes are there so there is synthesis of prostaglandin g2 and then prostaglandin h2 so prostaglandin h2 form prostaglandin h2 pgd2 pge2 pg2 alpha pgi2 pg and tx thromboxin a2 is synthesized out of all these things pg2 alpha and pge2 holds eminent importance in the physiological functions coming to the types of pg so how many uh, uh, there are four types of pg uh, prostaglandins are there but out of the this the pg2 alpha actually the pge2 is important so as as i am delivering this lecture exclusively on veterinary so these two hormones extensively used in both veterinary as well as medical practices okay the name of pg2 alpha pg2 alpha why this name is so uh, is so given so because it is phosphate soluble and pg2 alpha is ether soluble so e means ether soluble pg2 alpha means phosphate phosphate soluble very important so pga1 is another than that is the secretion in gid secretion gastrointestinal secretion pge1 bronchol bronchial dilation vasodilation initiation of platelet function so all these are related to the uh, physiological functions except your reproductive system so how the hormone gets synthesized and how it transported from its synthesis point to the uh, action point so pg is secreted from the cl corpus luteum and endometrial lining very very important cl is your cl is at corpus luteum is your ovary and endometrium is your uterus after release from the uterus it passes to the uterovenous artery very very important it never passes through the vein it passes only through artery ultimately uterovenous vein then from the vein to artery at the tissue level and finally to the ovary so this type of uh, circulation is known as retrograde circulations okay the circulation due to the uh, movement of the prostaglandin in relation to uh, retrograde circulations very important questions uh, frequently asked in examinations so that how in how many ways or in how how many ways the prostaglandin get uh, detoxified or get metabolized so mostly 8 to 19 cases lungs detoxify this hormone uh, hormone and less fraction by liver very important so those animals who suffering from any long stitches they are poorer uh, metabolizer of this hormone appearance in milk after administration is remote so milk can can be consumed so as i have told the uh, hormone cannot be found in blood so uh, in milk also this uh, hormone found to be less so milk can be consumed in horses 100% degradation occurs in lungs not 80 90% it's 100% and no hepatic degradation will occur no lung no degradation at liver occurs so coming to the functions of this hormone so as well as it is a luteolating hormone means it degrades or the it uh, destroys the corpus luteum on the ovary which is responsible for pregnancy of the pregnancy as well as let coming to the heat after parturition so it occurs so this hormone luteal so this hormone destroys this corpus luteum and this hormone all uh, is frequently used by the many veterinarians para veterinarians as a heat inducing agent also second third contraction of the smooth muscle of the git reproductive tract so expulsion of the fetus and fetal membranes can be achieved so as well as so as this hormones uh, have some properties like contraction of the smooth muscle so during the parturition and the git disturbances so veterinarians also pushing this hormone another is there is a responsible for erection erection gamete transport ovulation 
फॉर्मेशन ऑफ द कॉर्पस ल्यूटियम पार्चुरेशन एक्सपर्शन ऑफ द फिटल मेम्ब्रेन इन्वॉल्यूशन मिल्क प्रोडक्शन इनकी जब इस्ट्रोजन स्टिमुलेट थी पिज रिलीज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो इस्ट्रोजन इज रेन सिक्रेटेड फ्रॉम द थिका इंटरनल सेल्स ऑफ द योर ग्राफियन फॉलिकल्स व्हेन व्हेन द ग्राफियन फॉलिकल सिक्रेट्स द योर इस्ट्रोजन्स दिस इस्ट्रोजन स्टिमुलेट थी पिज रिलीजेस फ्रॉम द एंडोमेट्रियम सो इंक्रीज इन द पिज सो इंक्रीज इन द प्रोस्टाग्लांडिन रिलीजेस स्टिमुलेट ऑक्सीटोसिन एंड वाइस वर्सा सो इस्ट्रोजन स्टिमुलेट थी प्रोडक्शन ऑफ पिज पिज स्टिमुलेट थी प्रोडक्शन ऑफ द ऑक्सीटोसिन सो यू हैव टू रिमेम्बर द होल मेकानिजम कॉन्वर्ट टू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड सो इन काओ सीप गोड्स पिज यू ट्वेल्व फॉर डोनट कॉज एन रिग्रेस ऑफ द सीएल फॉर फाइव डेज फॉलोइंग स्ट्रोस सपोज ए काओ इज इन स्ट्रोस एंड इट क्रॉस विथ ए बुल ओके देन सम वन इज कॉलिंग टू ए वेटनेर नो सपोज यू आर ए वेटनेर सर प्लीज आबर्ट माई काओ ओके डू आबर्ट ऑन माई काओ सो रिमेम्बर वेरी वेरी इंपोर्टाट आफ्टर स्ट्रोस दिस सीएल इज नट डेवलप एंड सी एल एंड दिस हर्मोन व्वेन यू एडमिस्टर फॉर फाइव डेज आफ्टर दि स्ट्रोस इट विल नट वर्क सिमिलर इन पिक्स अल्सो इट डज नट कॉज यूटिलइज दिस विद इन दि ट्वेल्व डेज स्ट्रोस वेरी वेरी इंपोर्टेंट सपोज स्ट्रोस इज जीरो डे अप टू फाइव डेज इफ यू गिव पिजी दिस विल नट वर्क सो अप टू ट्वेल्व डेज अफ दि स्ट्रोस इफ यू गिव पिजी टू दि योर पिग इट विल नट वर्क इट इज वेरी वेरी इंपोर्टेंट कंसेप्ट सो वाइल गोइंग फॉर क्लिनिकल प्रैक्टिस यू शुड हैव सम नॉलेज रिगार्डिंग द प्रोस्टल लैंडिंग्स इन मेयर्स मीन्स दि फिमेल हॉर्सेस दि पिजी दि प्रोस्टल लैंडिंग कैन अवर्सन इफ एन इफ गिवेन एनी लो डज बट इट एक्ट एज ए सिस्टमिक वी सो इट कैन बी गिवेन इंट्रामोस्कुलर इंट्रावेनस रूट्स सो डिफरेन्ट टाइप्स ऑफ पिजी इज हर्मोन्स वन इज प्रोस्टिन प्रोस्टिन इज ए फॉर्म ऑफ योर प्रोस्टा ग्लैंडिन दैट इज यूज इन हॉर्सेस सो इन क्लिनिकल प्रैक्टिस हाउ कैन वी यूज द पिजी सो आई हैव टोल्ड आज दर इज परसीस्टेंस कॉर्पस ल्यूटियम व्हिच कॉजेस लेट कमिंग टू द हीट एज वेल एज एनी एंडोमेट्रियल डिसीजेस लाइक योर पायोमेट्रियल कंडीशन देन एट द टाइम यू कैन एडमिस्टर योर पिजी एंड दैट प्रोस्टा ग्लैंडिन कॉजेस ल्यूटिलाइसिस टर्मिनेशन टू पार्थोलॉजिकल प्रेगनेंसी लाइक ड्रॉपसिकल कंडीशंस लाइक योर हाइड्रो आलांटोइस हाइड्रो आमनियन सो दिज आर द ड्रॉपसिकल कंडीशन ऑफ द फिटोस एंड दिस टाइप्स ऑफ कंडीशंस आर फ्रीक्वेंटली एनकाउंटर्ड ड्यूरिंग योर प्रेगनेंसी सो इन दिस कंडीशन वी कैन गिव दि योर पीजी टू टर्मिनेट दिस कर्पस ल्यूटी थर्ड केस इन केजेस इट डज नट कॉज इन एडवर्स इफेक्ट ऑफ नॉर्मालिटी ओके इन स्ट्रोसिंक्रोनाइजेशन ऑल्सो वी आर गिविंग लाइक इन योर पी जी एफ पी जी सॉरी जी पी जी प्रोटोकॉल जी पी जी 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 एन आर एच पी जी जी एन आर एच सो इन केस वी आर गिविंग इट एज ए स्ट्रोसिंक्रोनाइजेशन प्रोसीजर इन साइलेंट स्ट्रोस ऑल्सो वी आर गिविंग बिकॉज ऑनोट इज स्ट्रोस और साइलेंट स्ट्रोस इट इज ऑल्सो वेरी हेल्पफुल इन सॉफ्टिंग एंड्रोमाइट्राइटिस इट इज एडवाइजेबल टू गिव प्रोस्टाग्लान इंस्टेड ऑफ एंटीबायोटिक्स बिकॉज इन सॉफ्टिंग एंड्रोमाइट्राइटिस द बैक्टेरियल लोड इनसाइड द एंड्रोमेट्रियम इज वेरी लो बट बट इट कॉजेस ए सिग्निफिकेंट लॉस व्हेन यू आर गिविंग पीजी प्रोस्टाग्लानिन व्हाट आई हैव टोल्ड इट हैज सम भाषो कंस्ट्रक्टर इफेक्ट भाषो कंस्ट्रक्ट इफेक्ट व्हेन इट पुट्स सो देयर इज एनहांस ब्लड सप्लाई टू दि यूटर एंड वेन सो वेन देर इज हेवी लोड ऑफ योर ब्लड इनसाइड द वेन दि बैक्टेरिया और दि कॉजेटिव दि कॉजेटिव ऑर्गानिजम्स क्यान भी कॉलोनाइज दे आर सो इट एक्सपल्स इज दि पाथोलोजिकल ऑर्गानिजम सो इन सम केसेज सपिंग एंडोमेट्रिक पी जी प्रोस्टाग्लानिन इज एडवाइजेबल नाउ डेज इट इज गिवेन एट द टाइम ऑफ ए आई सब लिप्टल डोजेस The scientists are telling uh, there is more chances of your angiotic conception. So, but post-coital as well post-partum uh, anestrus the PG is used because the parameter condition nothing but the persistence of your corpus luteum. That's why we are giving parameter cases. And also, it is very important that the medical termination of pregnancy in veterinary cases 
MTP cases also you have to give it the termination of the pregnancy. PG is used for Stagland. But in human cases, the prostaglandin cases is not used, not used. In human cases, a combination of the mifepristone is used to because it is a anti prolactin hormone, sorry, anti progesterone hormone, mifepristone. But in but in cattles, it is always PG. So in some cases, the practical cases, PG plus dexamethagon, dexa, is the drug of choice to give for medical termination of pregnancy. So this, if we are giving excess PG prostaglandin, then it can be inhibited by the a, a compound known as endomethacin injection. So I have given, I have collected some the uh, generic name of the uh, compound prostaglandin that is chloprostenol it is uh, this is the generic name this is our brand, under this this generic name the brand name is chloprostenol pragma vetmet of different pharmacological components are available in the market so tia prost is the is illerin brand name is illerin liprostol dinoprost lutelates and it is frequently and it is in most odisha this condition this uh, hormone is frequently used so dinoprost is the natural one, prostaglandin, that's why its dose is little bit higher, five ml intramuscular, and the clostenol is two ml. So synthetic PG has more efficiency than natural one, but it is more toxic for the natural sources. That's why the natural sources requires a higher dose, as compared to the synthetic source, it is lower dose. So hope. Uh, I have given some basic and valuable information regarding the prostaglandins. So, hope you will enjoy this video. And if you have some doubts and queries, then please give your valuable suggestion below my comment box. Thank you.